Hi, I'm here at Isabel Elementary in Haley Walker's first grade classroom to show you her great system she has for her differentiated workstations. So first of all, after each assessment, Haley looks at the kiddos and she puts them into pairs based on how they did on the assessment. Then she simply prints out a list with numbered pairs for each student. So those pairs of kids are going to change after each assessment as she sees what each um, kiddo is needing to work on. Her stations list just goes up on her board. The little magnets next to some kids indicates on that day who gets to use the technology piece, the iPads that are in the classroom. She also uses that list of kids for stations. That helps her pull her teacher table groups. She could say um, pairs 1 through 4 come to teacher table or 9 through 11 come to teacher table. So it helps her organize her teacher table groups also. She then has a tub for each pair. So they are responsible for their own tub, which really helps with them taking responsibility for cleaning it up and taking care of what is inside the tub. Each tub is then differentiated for the two kiddos that will be using that tub. It has plenty of activities in it, so they will be busy during the entire math work block and not run out of things to do. She also uses duplicates in many of the tubs, so she doesn't have to be doing specific individualized things for each kid. One activity might go in, you know, tubs one through four, for example. Another set of activities might go in, you know, tubs four through seven. So there's many duplicates in there. Then can also just pick spiraling activities, anything that she just knows that certain pair of kid needs to go back and work on. Then in each tub, the kids have whatever materials they're going to need to do the activities, dry erase markers, manipulatives. In each activity, she puts the number of the tub on the top of it also. So they again have that piece of accountability when it's cleanup time, knowing what goes back in the tub so they don't lose any pieces. And you can see in this one tub, she has a wide variety of different activities in there. So this is a really great organizational system for her. It's easy to set up. It's definitely differentiated based on her students' needs, and she has had a lot of success with it this year. Thanks. Bye-bye.